Hey, what's up, fellas? How you doing? Man, it's here. Hey, what's going on, guys? How we doing? Matt Antonelli here. So I'm about to head out to baseball for pretty much the entire day today. Um, but yesterday, uh, we had some not so good news uh, regarding COVID, the MLB, and players testing positive. And we're at a point right now where I do think um, the season could potentially be in jeopardy. I don't think you know, some people are saying cancel the season, it's all over. I don't think we're at that point yet. Um, but we're only four days into the season. And I mean, there could be a potential disaster in our hands. So let's let's get through uh, a bunch of different tweets here. First one is from Jeff Passan. He tweeted yesterday, he said, eight more players and two coaches with the Miami Marlins have tested positive for COVID-19 as an outbreak has spread throughout their clubhouse and brought the total of cases in recent days to at least 14. Sources familiar with the situation tell me and Jesse Rogers, ESPN. Then he tweets out, the Marlins home opener against the Baltimore Orioles tonight has been canceled, sources tell ESPN as the team remains in Philadelphia and continues to undergo testing. Now, this was um, released by Major League Baseball. This is their statement, said tonight's Marlins, Orioles, and Phillies, Yankees games postponed. Tonight's scheduled games between the Miami Marlins and the Baltimore Orioles at Marlins Park and the Philadelphia Phillies and the New York Yankees at Citizens Bank Park have been postponed while Major League Baseball conducts additional COVID-19 testing. So then Scott Miller of Bleach Report, he tweeted out, the MLB hope is to regroup today as Marlins remain quarantined in Philly, and depending on today's test results, team would bust to Baltimore and play tomorrow's game there instead of Miami, with others from Taxi Squad joining club there and subbing in, according to industry sources. Then Ken Rosenthal said Philly's getting tested today at Citizens Bank Park. Sources tell The Athletic players are heading to park, then straight home, not allowed to stay at field. Okay, so this is obviously a very bad situation, not just for the Miami Marlins, but for Major League Baseball as a whole. First, you have a Marlins team where this virus is starting to spread throughout the team. Um, they don't know exactly how it started yet, um, but what I have heard is that there was a rain delay and the players could not stay socially distanced. And so they all had to kind of jam into the dugout. Was that where it started the spread? I don't know. Um, you know, it depends. I don't know how the, the team was was uh, socially distancing beforehand, if players were making sure to stay away from each other. You know, when you're playing baseball, it's tough to always remain six feet away from every single player on your team. Uh, but then you also have the Phillies who... You know, just played the Marlins, so now they've got to get tested. Did any of the Marlins players give that to the Phillies, which then pass it on to their team? So things could spread quickly. Uh, hopefully everyone is okay. Let's look at David Price here. So David Price, who opted out for the season uh, probably a couple of weeks ago, he tweeted last night and said, Now we really get to see if MLB is going to put players' health first. Remember when Manfred said players' health was paramount? Part of the reason I'm at home right now is because players' health wasn't being put first. I can see that hasn't changed. So I think what happens over the next week or so is is probably going to determine if we continue to play baseball this summer. Again, I know there's a lot of people saying shut everything down now. And there's some people that are saying this is no big deal. Um, but this is a, a good amount of players testing positive from one team. And so... Um, you know, how much does that spread? Does it continue to spread throughout the team or have they figured out a way to put a stop to it? Did it spread to other teams? Do any of the Phillies test positive? All things we'll see in the next couple of days. And I think that could determine, you know, how the rest of the season goes. So I think Major League Baseball knew there were going to be some speed bumps along the way. This is probably a little bit quicker into the season than they thought. We're only a couple days into the season and we're already having this. Um, but We'll see what happens here. Something to definitely monitor and keep our eyes on. But as of right now, just a couple of games canceled. Everyone else will continue to play as normal. So I'll let you know if I hear anything else. Thanks so much for watching. i got to go to baseball now. It's been a long day of uh, we've got lessons going on. We've got team practices and all kinds of stuff. So I will uh, talk to you guys later. Thanks again. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Give it a thumbs up. All that good stuff. Thanks to our patrons on Patreon for supporting the channel. And we will talk to you later.